AS Academy took out the home side 1-0 in its opening match and then went on to defeat Labasa FC of Fiji 2-1 goals in its second match. The new Caledonia team has two matches ahead to wrap up the title. They face the winless Kiwi FC from Samoa on Thursday and a much stronger opposition in Kolowale FC of Solomon Islands in their final match. So what does this mean for the home team, Hekari United, and its aspiration to win the inaugural women's OFC at home soil, given that AS Academy Feminine are now the frontrunners? Hekari United must beat Kolowale FC this Thursday before holding off Labasa FC. It won't come easy as both oppositions have displayed some great football in their previous two matches. However, Hekari United will be coming off the back of a good rest in the round three matches. They should be fresh and ready to get these games with convincing victories. The round robin format gives Hekari United advantage as whoever scores the highest number of goals in the league could be announced winner. Hekari lost its first matches to AS Academy it won its second against Kiwi FC 9-0 and so sits on top with highest number of goals scored, putting them in a frame of grabbing the title. However, the road towards grabbing the title is tough because there are two quality opponents in Kolowale FC and Labasa FC. Meanwhile, the competition resumes this Thursday at Sir Hubert Murray Stadium. AS Academy will play Kiwi FC and Koloale FC will take on the host Hekari United FC. Rex Lita, TV1 Sports.